Hello, my name is Brandon, and welcome to Retro Reactions, a place where I experience amazing music from the 70s, 80s, and 90s for the very first time. And today we're going to be headed all the way back to 1977 to listen to both Black Cow and Josie by the amazing Steely Dan. Can't believe I've only done about four reactions to this amazing band, so definitely excited to check out two more. Anyway, if you're new here, welcome. Don't forget to hit that subscribe and like button, as well as the notification bell to join the Retro Reactions crew, where it's all amazing music all the time. Here we go. Steely Dan's sound is so unbelievably cool, so remarkable, and so unique to them. You hear it, you know it's them. It's hard to explain, you know. They just have a way with their melodies, their instrumentation, and I think a lot has to do with the uh, vocal melodies, how they're written and presented, the harmonies, how they intertwine with each other. They're including four female singers here, back and forth, and just so amazing, and, you know, just a funky, funky, jazzy sound. I love it. I love the funky, deep, deep bass lines in the beginning, just started the song off strong and really kind of forced me to get moving and dancing. That's how funky it was. That's how amazing it sounded. Uh, I love that they use female singers here. Again, there's four of them. I'll name them later. Uh, but I love that not only are they background vocalists and that they complement the same lines in different harmonies as uh, Donald, you know, the lead singer, but also the fact that they uh, kind of have their own vocal lines, just them singing at one point. So it's like a back and forth. And I love that. Just adds flavor to these kind of songs. I love the great clavinet sound going on on the right side here. Just adds so much funk to this song that's already funky. I love it. Um, and again, we get their signature brass sound. I don't think it's the saxophone, which is coming in later, I think. But maybe it's a synthesized brass just so classic to Steely Dan and fits perfectly where it came in in the song. Now I see we're about to get some amazing keys coming in. Maybe a keyboard solo. I think that's done by the Fender Rhodes and really excited to hear it. So let's check it out.
excellent song right up my alley in so many different ways especially that keyboard solo wow we'll talk about that more <laughs> wow what an excellent steely dan song uh the keyboard solo after my pause absolutely incredible definitely my favorite part of the song no surprise there to many of you it felt like a dream within the rest of the song and i love that it took its time i thought it was going to end then it kept going i probably made a happy expression there um, it felt like i was moving on waves it was just so cool so interesting so relaxing so jazzy funky all at once but just love that section and then more of that brass in the background just adding layers and layers upon that beautiful keyboard solo and just loved it completely then the main song kicked back in you know back to reality back to the funky danceable music there um, chorus so catchy in this song definitely impactful loved it easy to uh, vibe with easy to learn and sing with you know uh, just so much going on here so much greatness i knew there was going to be a tenor sax and that was amazing started doing its thing adding more flavor but then when they put the sax with the brass with the female vocalists that sound together was heaven and of course the bass and drums were accompanying that perfectly as well and finally a nice slow fade out uh, just perfect couldn't ask for anything more in this song so i'm going to check out the lyrics now Yet again, another song, you know, juxtaposing two different ideas between the lyrics and the music. Here we got these charged lyrics uh, against this really funky, jazzy song. So interesting. Uh, to me, it's a story about a man who sees an ex-girlfriend or old flame in a bar. She's now a sad, lost woman, high on some kind of drug. He's done with her. He's had enough, especially knowing now that she is either a prostitute or getting uh, with multiple partners and, you know, he has no chance anymore and he realizes that he was once her rock her shoulder to cry on he did it for a long time but now he simply doesn't care wow what a song instant love for it i'm gonna rate this one five super shiny golden records the shiniest ones i have four black cow 1977 by steely dan thank you donald fagan paul humphrey chuck rainey victor feldman joe sample Larry Carlton, Tom Scott, and the four female vocalists, Clyde King, Shirley Matthews, Vanetta Fields, and Rebecca Lewis. Appreciate the stellar work by everyone. All right, now we're moving on to Josie from the same album, Asia, uh, from 1977, of course. Looks like this was their third single from this album, and it actually hit number 26 on the U.S. Billboard Hot 100 charts. Interesting. Looks like we're getting more rock, jazz, and R&B here. So this should be a great one. And as always, Timothy B. Schmidt, again, making another surprise appearance, of course, from the Eagles, love his voice. And once again, he's doing backup on this one. So excited to check it out. Let's go.
change up there gotta go back and hear it again you know i love change ups what a song wow so groovy a little bit funky again but i can totally see why this was a single a lot happening here upbeat and just so much goodness in this song yet again really unexpected guitar intro there um, i don't uh, associate electric guitar so much with steely dan up to this point at least i don't know too many of their songs yet but really nice uh, unexpected change then the song kicked in and we got this really really cool bass line right up front and really stood out the uh you know the lines written for the bass really impactful really driving the song along and i think is it the was that from the bass i think it was the high notes of the bass it appeared several times in the song and that sounded amazing and again different i love different in uh, instruments so Definitely loving this one. I love the tempo here. Perfect to groove with. Um, the electric piano parts sounded amazing. And the vocals, wow. Very powerful lead and backup vocals. More so than Black Cow, I would say. Right in the front. Very hard hitting, impactful. Uh, see, we're getting a change up here and it sounded really nice. So I'm gonna go back and see what it has to offer. really interesting way to end it faded out there with the whole brass du, 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 over and over did not expect that many surprises in this song actually uh let's go back a little bit here that heavenly synth on the upper left i forgot to mention it you know in the pause but appeared several times i think during the chorus i started hearing it in the latter half but just amazing heaven thank you donald for doing that absolutely just added another element to an already amazing song uh, again many surprises here we got a pause in the music you saw my reaction that was a big surprise i love when songs do that the longer the better it was a pretty quick pause maybe a couple seconds but that sounded amazing and then we got a nice guitar solo maybe a couple of solos i'm not sure i can't remember but that sounded great and then a huge huge surprise that kind of crazy uh, unexpected uh, electric guitar introduction to the very song 
reappeared there and very interesting sound kind of different sound than the rest of the song and it just kind of captures your attention like whoa we're back at this point again did not expect that whatsoever then more interesting brass lines like i talked about fading out into the end uh, they do amazing work with their brass whether it's real or synthesized it's so signature steely dan and i love it anyway a completely well-rounded excellent song gonna check out the lyrics now Wow, so again, more kind of crazy, unexpected lyrics. Apparently, Josie is quite the woman. Or is Josie a metaphor for something else that makes the town go wild? Question mark. She's the talk of the town, the firecracker, the catalyst for vices. She seems to be promiscuous as well, but does all that come with a veil of religious guilt? Question mark. Uh, Love by all, they await eagerly every time she returns to town. Simple as that. Wow, again, so blown away by this amazing Steely Dan song, just like the first one, Black Cow. I have to rate this one. Five super shiny golden records. Once again, the shiniest ones I have. Amazing musicians, amazing songs, amazing emotions, amazing output, amazing treats for uh, my ears, my brain, my heart, my soul. So thank you so much, Donald Fagan, Timothy B. Schmidt, and all the uh, other session players for this amazing song, Josie, 1977 by Steely Dan. All right, that's it for today. Thank you so, so much for watching, especially if you made it here to the end. I know this was a longer one, but I'm so glad I got to crank out two amazing songs by one band today. Anyway, don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment down below if you wish to chat about these songs or anything Steely Dan. Would love to know your input. Anyway, you take care, stay safe, stay hydrated, and remember to let peace, calm, and light into your day and night. And I'll see you next time in the past.